Hi, I'm Tony. Today we'll be exploring how boarding students at Cho choose to decorate their dorm rooms. We'll give you an inside look on a variety of single and double rooms and introduce some students how they choose to customize their living spaces. Let's go. Hi, Supriya. Would you be able to show us your room? Yeah, of course. Great, let's go in. So, Sakriya, so tell us how you decorate your room. Um, I like to decorate my room with photos and lights and lots of and lots of pillows. As a three-year junior right now, how do you think your style of decorating your room has evolved through the years? Yeah, definitely. So, I think freshman and sophomore year, I went with a little bit more of a childish theme with um, mint green and pastel blue and white. Um, but this year, I decided to make it a little more mature. Um, oh. So more neutral, such as beige, white, black. Lastly, how do you think the way you set up your room affects your productivity throughout your day? Yeah, I think that I tried to set up my room in a way that would help me and make my day most efficient. Um, so I set up my dresser with all my jewelry and I hung my belts on the side in front of the mirror so that when I'm getting ready in the morning, I'm able to like accessorize really quickly and like see what looks really good together. Um, I also put a calendar and a whiteboard to put reminders and just keep everything organized. Um, and finally, I put a bunch of photos on my wall to remind myself to reach out to the people who I know. Oh, that's so sweet. Sweet. For me. <laughs> so sweet. Well, thank you for showing us your room, Supriya. Yeah, of course. Hey, hey guys, hey. come on in. Dara and Sarah, tell us how you decorated your room. So we basically wanted it to be super like minimalistic. We didn't want a lot of stuff going on so it wasn't too cluttered. Um, Sarah and I like both decorated our sides with stuff that we like. Yeah. And then we both kind of, each of our sides have a little bit of individual aspects. So Dara has photos and some prints and I have some band posters and different prints that I put up. So we kind of got to create our own sides differently. Oh, that's really interesting. How do you think decorating a room at Cho affects your productivity? Um, so we kind of decided to make our room pretty minimalistic just so that the walls weren't super crowded and we wouldn't get distracted easily, so that definitely has affected our productivity. And then obviously our room is on the bigger side, so we don't really feel super cramped and claustrophobic. Welcome! This is the room. So John, tell us how you decorate your room. Well, honestly, there's not too much decoration here. I have a couple of posters that I like of Mount Fuji. I have uh, a SpongeBob poster behind me, some Tabasco, but not, not too much else. It's more uh, practicality than it is decoration. Mm. And as a prefect, how do you think a prefect room is different from any other boarder's room? Uh, well, mostly the prefects, they get the first choice on whatever room, so obviously in your dorms you'll probably pick the biggest room, so this is the one I chose. And what are some special prefect privileges in dorm rooms? Uh, we get a mini fridge that's right over there. We also get access to, um, like gaming consoles or like PC, you can hook it up to the internet, um, play video games. Uh, and yeah, that's basically it. Mm, great. Do a lot of kids come here to talk to you about life and stuff? Oh yeah, all the time. Literally, like, even if I'm not on duty, kids will stop by my room, they'll hang out on the couch, we'll just, like, talk about whatever. Uh, so it's a pretty, pretty welcoming, uh, space for a lot of people. Mm. Well, thank you for showing us your room, John. Yeah, you're welcome. Hmm, I wonder what dorms you can go to next. Oh, hey Trista. Oh, hey! Wanna show us your room for the video? Sure, follow me! <laughs> Yeah, just uh, go. Okay, guys. Whoa! There's plenty of room in here. Come on in. Just uh, <laughs> where's your room? Oh, this is it. I'm a day student. Next up on our list of dorms, we'll be visiting Combination House, which is Choate's pilot program for all gender housing. Let's take a look inside. Hi, Hello. guys. Welcome to Combination. My name is Nico, and I'm one of the prefects. Can I show us your room? Yes, of course. Let's go.
Um, I really like cute things, so that's why I have so many like cute things around my room. Um, I really enjoy surrounding myself by things that make me happy, so that's why um, a lot of it is very pastel and bright. And as you can probably tell, um, I'm a big fan of K-pop, so um, a lot of my a lot of my room is decorated with some of my favorite like. K-pop artists, and I also love birds, so I have a poster of birds above my bed, so when I wake up in the morning, I can see uh, the birds above my bed because I can't see them outside like I usually do when I'm home. Combination has been a wonderful experience this year. Hey, come on in. Um, I would say my personal style is, I'm a little bit more edgy, I would say, than my roommates. So my roommates really like, um, things that are really cute, I would say, and, um, I don't know, very aesthetic things, whereas I like things that are, like, I really like film photos, I like movie posters and things like that. I think all of us, like, individually have our own style, but it kind of works well together. Like, this side of the room has less decorated decorations, and that side of the room kind of is, like, more decorative and aesthetic and things like that, so. So, if you're going to give advice to yourself as a freshman going into boarding school, mm -hmm. what advice would you give about rooms and decorating rooms? Okay. Um, firstly, I would say don't bring too much stuff, because freshman year I brought way too much clothes, way too much, like, decoration, things like that, and I didn't have space to put anything. Um, second, secondly, I think I would say don't try too hard. I think I've learned over the years that just put whatever you like and whatever you don't, it's, it'll just like clutter everywhere, so. Okay, well thank you for showing us your room. Mm -hmm.